this is the herb garden that we got the guinea pig. Well, it was already there, but we used this for the guinea pig. It has a variety of different herbs, which is good, as um, guinea pigs love, our guinea pigs love herbs. So this is Noodle's new wheel. It's really big and it looks natural, so we really like this compared to his old plastic one. So when we went to the vets, they gave us this medicine for the gerbils. Um, I have to cover this up because it has our address on it. Um, but this is what they gave us. Um, it's for their urine infection because we're not quite sure which one it is. Um, we need to take, take these ESA stickers down, so I'll probably do that tonight. Um, so I just need to put a millimetre of this in there. Um, Thing. It's as it like is it fine for their water as it'd be quite hard to give them medicine. So I'm gonna do that now. So I've just put their water bottle back on with the medicine now in it. Um as you can see it's very messy in here, it's because this morning I gave them a chew toy, like a little carrot one. And they like completely demolished it into like tiny crumbs of orange. So I'm going to actually be cleaning them out soon. Well, tomorrow. So um, hopefully this will disappear as we also have purple bits because they chewed up an egg box. I'm going to take off these stickers. So the gerbils have just um, actually run out of food. Unfortunately, it was the Erin's Ark stuff, which is quite annoying because like we got this once. We hope to purchase this in the future, but it does cost money for postage as we don't live in Scotland and um, we have to buy other stuff with it. So right now we've just got this Hampton gerbil mix. As you can see, it's safer gerbils as well. Um, we get this extra select stuff for our guinea pig um, usually as well. So it's all fine. So I'm just going to pour that into the box. So they do run out of food quite often because there are four of them and they do quite like to eat a lot. None of them are overweight. Here's Coco eating. Oh, Piccolo. So yeah, I just gave them the rest of that food. Um, I also give them these sometimes. I'll like crunch them up, but I prefer to keep them in a pot for the moment. So there is their food. So I've decided that I'm actually going to clean out the gerbils today so I've got all of their stuff in a bag here and their cage is current well their home is currently empty they are in here you can't really see them but they are in here and we're just gonna fill it up now <laughs> 